This is what to watch on Wall Street for Tuesday, October 6th. As the earnings season picks up once again, we're paying attention to some key companies. PepsiCo is slated to come out with its numbers before the market opens. And then fast food company Yum! Brands releases its results after the market close. When PepsiCo reports its third quarter earnings, analysts are calling for earnings of $1.27 a share on revenue of over $16 billion. The stronger dollar is expected to weigh down on the global snack and beverage company's financial data. As a result, its international markets like Mexico, Russia and Brazil will likely see some headwinds. Wells Fargo analysts are also saying that soda and snacks volumes may be soft in the recent quarter. While earnings are expected to fall short of estimates, the street's Jim Creamer is hopeful on the company's snack business. Now, PepsiCo has its snack business, Frito-Lay, which has been the driver. Really difficult article this weekend about soda, the challenges there. I want PepsiCo to address the idea that maybe soda is just a permanently declining business. But remember, that's more Coca-Cola's problem than it is PepsiCo's. Some important reports to look out for on the economic calendar. The international trade data comes out at 8.30 a.m. Eastern. For August, the international trade gap is forecasted to get wider. Economists predict the trade deficit to be $48.6 billion, compared to nearly $42 billion the month before. At 8.55, the Red Book is due out, and then we end the day with San Francisco Fed head John Williams giving a speech in his city. And that's what we're watching on Tuesday. For the latest financial news and updates from Wall Street, check back on thestreet.com throughout the day. I'm Eugene Lee in New York.